Welcome to Easy A Homeschool Academy. Today, we will learn about tsunamis. What is a tsunami? A tsunami is a natural occurrence that is triggered by the movement of the Earth's crust. It describes enormous waves that are caused by seismic activity, such as volcanic eruptions, earthquakes, and landslides. Tsunamis can last for several hours. These strong, powerful waves hitting the shoreline can last for hours or even days after the initial wave. How are tsunamis formed? The sudden movement or displacement of large bodies of water creates tsunamis. For example, if an earthquake occurs in the deep ocean, its shock waves can cause the seafloor to shift, which may lead to the displacement of water. This, in turn, can create enormous waves. As these waves make their way to land, they will gain power and speed creating a potentially devastating situation. When and where do tsunamis form? A tsunami can form anywhere in the world where there are large bodies of water like an ocean or sea. It is difficult to predict exactly where or when they will occur and residents of tsunami prone or coastal regions are encouraged to stay informed by knowing where to go and what to bring should an evacuation of the area becomes necessary. Consequences of a Tsunami Tsunamis are formed because of the sudden movement of the Earth's crust, which leads to the displacement of large bodies of water. This displacement will create very big waves that can travel up to 500 miles per hour as they move towards land. Tsunamis can travel across entire oceans before reaching the coast. Once the waves reach the mainland, they can destroy everything in their path, including buildings, vehicles, vegetation, and people. Receding waters are just as dangerous as advancing waters as they drag all of the debris back into the ocean. What can be done to prevent a tsunami? Tsunamis are natural occurrences and therefore they cannot be prevented. However, several measures can be taken to lessen their impact. Monitoring systems have been created across the world to track seismic activity. Scientists and researchers monitor earthquakes as they are happening around the world and will warn people living in low-lying coastal regions and other locations prone to tsunamis in an effort to evacuate areas that may be affected. In addition, there are early warning systems like buoys and sensors that send messages to people living near tsunami-prone areas. Knowing how a tsunami can affect the environment and understanding their impact is one way to stay safe should a tsunami develop in your area. People living in coastal regions and or near other large bodies of water are encouraged to listen for alerts warning residents of a possible tsunami. Also, be sure to have emergency evacuation plans and supplies on hand should they become necessary. Tsunamis can have serious consequences. The seismic activities like volcanic eruptions, earthquakes, or landslides that trigger these enormously powerful waves can further devastate the affected regions, which can lead to the loss of life. Being aware of their causes and effects on the environment is one way to be prepared in the event of a tsunami happening in your area. I hope you learned something about tsunamis today. Thank you for taking this learning journey with me. Until next time. As always, thank you for watching. Tell us what you want to see next. Email easyahomeschoolacademy at yahoo.com.
like and share our videos, please subscribe to our channel.